Yo, what's up guys? Welcome back to another Bill Burr video. So I know in the last one, we didn't really get to see this guy work his magic on stage, but you know what? We're probably not gonna get to see it again because we got a <laughs> helicopter story, but you know what? My boy Reg requested this along with so many other people. Like, comment, subscribe, hit us up if you guys enjoy this content. And I'm ready to watch some more Bill Burr. Me too. Let's go. Let's go. Let's see what you're talking about, Bill Burr. Let's see. I saw this story down in Orange County, right? Down in Orange County, California, this guy gave helicopter tours for 30 years. 30 years without incident, hands the business off to his son, the American dream. I built it up for 30 years, here you go, son. <laughs> Mixed family and the family name proud. All right, dad, I love you, All right? Four kids, <laughs> five days in. He's supposed to give a tour to a couple, only the dude shows up. The kid thought it was weird, but he's like, I need the money, I gotta give him a tour, All right? So he takes this guy up, 10 minutes into the tour, the dude fucking jumped out. <laughs> yeah. <What? laughs> five days in. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Five days in from the balloons and the cake. We love you, son. Here's <laughs> the family tree going. The traditional life. Five fucking days later, this kid, he probably barely had the speech down. Just sitting there flying the helicopter. All right, if you look out the left side of the aircraft, <laughs> that's Orange County. Man, we really got to see this guy on a stage because... He's going to be so funny. Like, so much of comedy is, like, mannerisms and just the yeah. way you deliver it. And there's so many things that really come to the senses. And it's it's not really about, like, what they say. It's about just the presentation. Right. We got to see it, man. Just let us know in the comment section which live video do we need to see. Right. Over. Absolutely. 27 miles of beaches. Uh, put your seatbelt back on. 27 miles of beaches. <laughs> was established as a county in 1903. Sir, please don't open the door. Sir, what are you doing? Sir, no. No. Don't. Don't. Stop. No. No. Oh my what god. The fuck? <laughs> what the fuck? Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. What the fuck? What the fuck? He's cursed. Fuck! <laughs> Air traffic control. I don't know who's on this frequency, but you really need some kind of fucking helicopter. <laughs> Five days in. So I read further into the story. Turns out the guy who jumped out, he was 61 years old, terminally ill. He was in pain every day. They couldn't figure out what was wrong with him, and he had had enough. At that point, that guy immediately became a hero in my world, right? You know what I love about him? Not only did he make the decision, he didn't go out like some pussy, right? <laughs> Handful of pills, watching a romantic comedy, wrapped in an Afghan that Nana made. Fuck that. This guy went out like a man. Take me up in a chopper. I'm looking at the land I love, and then I'm jumping out like a superhero. I love it. <laughs> yeah. I mean, I guess in a sense, there's something romantic about that, like taking it into yeah, the hands. Yeah, but like, tell the driver. <laughs> tell yeah, but the like, driver. geez, at whose expense, man? Like, geez, traumatizing. And what if you're just down there? What if you're just chilling on Earth and like, here he comes. I'm sure he picked a really secluded spot. You know oh, what I'm saying? Oh, Lord. Here he comes. Oh, man. You notice how his neck looks a lot different? His neck <laughs> stood up. <laughs> this guy. This guy should have been wearing a fucking cape. <laughs> <laughs> then he would have made it. I can't imagine how elated he must have been on that helicopter ride up after finally, you know, just taking back control of his life. Like, fuck you, disease. I decide. <laughs> you know, moving out, gets a burger. Shotguns of beer, take me up in the chop. He probably had his fucking foot on the dashboard. You know, he's not even listening to this guy giving the tour, right? <laughs> he's like, Yeah, yeah, whatever. <laughs> this is the other end of it. Sorry, this is so good. <laughs> The hero of the story. I left out one small thing. There is one small thing. The guy fucking lived. Uh, yeah. No, he didn't. Yeah, they, were, they were out over the ocean, 500 feet up. You'd think that would be enough. So I'm thinking he must have gone in like. <laughs> it was just meant for him to live. <laughs> <laughs> he probably smacked the disease out when he hit the water. <laughs> oh man. Washed it out. Broke his back probably. <laughs> oh my god. Like no splashes. <laughs> <laughs> but witnesses said it looked like a dummy was falling out of the air. <laughs> so that sounds like a hell of an impact. <laughs> I think he accidentally did the most epic 500 foot belly flop in the history of jumping out of a helicopter. You know? 
but that didn't change what he was trying to do. <laughs> <laughs> Where his heart was, I still love this guy. Just, Just on the way down, he's got to be thinking three more seconds of pain. Two more seconds. <laughs> wow. <laughs> 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 oh my god, this is worse. This is worse. Oh my god. We gotta watch a movie after this. I'm hurting already. Why is my I am crying? <laughs> mm, man. Okay, okay. <laughs> it has a happy ending though. He later died at the hospital. <laughs> well, that's what he wanted, oh, yeah, but yeah. God bless him. I hope I have the ball someday. <laughs> <laughs> what? Oh my goodness. What was that? <laughs> Alright guys, welcome back to another episode of <laughs> Alright guys, so that was Bill Burr helicopter story. Uh that was out of left field, hundred percent. Didn't expect that coming. Uh, I mean and there's just something about that guy. I feel like the war of him is gonna live on in my mind for a long time. So it's unfortunate when he hit the water he had to endure, but I don't know, man. I, I hope that the freedom that he felt on that fall was worth the pain of the impact of smacking that water from 500 feet. <laughs> and good lord. Uh, I really like how the comedian in this one, um, Bill Burr, I guess, he had like told like both sides of the story. It's like he just gets lost funny. in his head. Like he's just, it's almost like he's playing the character, right? We he do just, that sometimes. Yeah, we exactly, like, we'll yeah, say the situations yeah. and just go way too far with them. We just go with yeah. it a lot. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes, yeah, a lot of fun. Guys, that was hilarious, man. Uh, Bill Burr is so funny. We really need to see this guy on a stage. I, I just want to see the way he like moves and delivers and holds the mic. And like I have this perception built up in my head, this expectation, and he's probably going to crush that. So <laughs> this guy is so funny. Please let us know if there's any more Bill Burr. There's, there's a long line of comedians that we need to get. We want to kind of take it back to the old school, man. So let us know who, who are some of the earliest comedians that really paved the way. Jerry Seinfeld. Right. We need to check out people like that, man. Some of the OGs and we just need to go on a comedy kick. So let us know in the comment section who you guys want to see next. Thank you guys so much for rocking with us and hanging out. We'll see you on the next video.